Hi everyone, I'm going to do the math for land test in order to standardize the bacterial probability or concentration to inoculate them on uh, plates in order to determine their antimicrobial susceptibility. Here I have E. coli isolates which are positive um, for AMPC and ESPL, it means that they are ESPL and AMPC producers, the two most important beta lactamases. They were put in the uh, freezer at minus 80 degrees Celsius, and then I, I refreshed them on blood plates and put them in the incubator uh, at 37 degrees Celsius overnight, and today, I want to uh, uh, determine their susceptibility to other antimicrobials. So I need to uh, standardize the, their turbidity or concentration. I need to do a mark for lamp. So uh, first off, I need to have a culture tube. I put three milliliter of double distilled water in this tube. And now I, I need to set the Mark Farland standard uh, machine uh, to blank in order to read the bacterial concentration appropriately. I clean the tube and then put here inside the machine and uh, change the nanometer from 610 to 625. 625 and then set that to zero. It will set the machine to blank. And this is the spectrum that treat bacteria and the range uh, and the turbidity range should be from 0 0.08 to 0 0.1. This is the, the turbidity range at which I want to standardize the bacteria. I will label that with the corresponding um, battery that I want to inoculate and transfer. 600 to 42 FPP. Then I take swap. These were hot clay, so they are sterile. I take a swap and then. Uh, wet the swab cotton tip to water to make taking the isolates or colonies easier and then take some few colonies and then inoculate that to my distilled water inside the tube And then I vortex the tube in order to kind of homogenize the mixture. I clean the tube. Okay, you see right now the concentration it rate is 0 0.113, which is for above the turbidity range that I need. So uh, when the bacterial concentration is higher than what I need, I should dilute that, I should add distilled water. These are double distilled water. I should add water to this. Take some water, then add Okay, let's see. I should vortex that again. Right now you see that the turbidity is uh, 0 0.092, which is within the range that we want. 
So that is okay. And uh, with this, the bacterial concentration and the probability is standardized. And now I can move forward with inoculated that to the plates. So I need a swab, a, a, a sterile swab. With that, I can take the bacteria, isolate, and I just add that. That's it, and I hope you have enjoyed it.